Uh, isang integration technique sa tinatawag nating integration by the U substitution, also known as the algebraic substitution. Okay, bakit tinatawag na U substitution? Kasi magsasubstitute ka, gagawin mong U. So, for example, uh, let's find the integral of this. So, nakakatakot, no? I-expand mo to the 8th power. Ang gawin natin, we let uh, U is equal to x cube. Pag kinuha mong derivative niyan with respect to x, so pag kinuha mo yung du over dx, ang makuha mo, syempre, 3x squared. At pag nirearrange mo to, I'm saying that dx is equal to du over 3x squared. Okay. Now, substitute natin yung u doon sa original equation natin. Mikita mo, this is the integral. Okay, the integral of x squared. Then, u equals x cubed. So, yung x cubed, palitan natin. Gawin natin u. Plus 5 raised to 8 dx. But, yung dx is du over 3x squared. So, maka-cancel yung x squared dito. And, ang matitira sa atin, is we have the integral of u plus 5 raised to 8 du over 3. Siyempre, ilalabas mo na yung 1 third. Uh, u plus 5 raised to 8 du. So, anong ginawa natin? Yung komplikadong integral naging mas simple in terms of u. Ito, madali na lang to using power rule. No, we have 1 third. Then, using power rule, magiging u plus 5 raised to 9. Tapos, i-divide natin ng 9. And, pag sinimplify mo yan, no, magiging 1 over 27 u plus 5 raised to 9. But, remember, u is equal to x cubed. So, we have the integral of x squared x cubed plus 5 raised to 8 dx is equal to 1 over 27. Yung u, ibalik natin into x. So, u is x cubed plus 5 raised to 9. And, wag kakalimutan yung integration uh, constant natin plus c. So, ganyan. Ganyan ang U substitution. Papalitan mo yung komplikadong term ng U para mas maging madali yung equation natin. Tulad nito, mas naging mas simple siya. Let's have another example. We have 2x cosine of 3x squared. So, ang gagawin ko, uh, we let uh, U is equal to x squared. And Pag dinerivative mo yan, you get du is equal to 2x dx. So, using u substitution, substitute natin siya sa equation. Yung original equation ko na 2x cosine 3x squared dx. No? Uh, pag nirearrange ko yan, this becomes cosine of 3x squared 2x dx. Pag pinalit ko yung u, values doon, makuha ako na ito ay magiging integral of cosine of 3. Ano yung x squared? Yung x squared ko ay u. So, 3u times yung 2x dx, yun ay equal sa du. And we can simply integrate it. The integral of a cosine 3u is 1 third sine 3 u c e integral ng cosine 3 u so para maging x ulit no balik mo siya sa pagiging x niya yung u palitan mo ng x squared so this becomes 1 third sine x squared a uh, sine 3 x squared plus c so this is the integral no 
2x cosine 3x squared. Let's have another example for the u substitution. So we have x cubed e x to the fourth. No, parang komplikado, but in this case we let x to the four equals u. Pag diniri batim mo yan, yun di yung mo, you will get four x cubed. Ah, dx or dx is du over 4x cubed. And substituting these values doon sa original equation natin, no, we get x cubed e raised to x to the 4 magiging e raised to u na lang dahil x fourth is u. And yung dx magiging du 4x cubed. Cancel yung x cubed and we are left with one fourth ng integral ng e raised to u du. At madali nang isolve to. This becomes one fourth. Ang integral ng e raised to u is simply e raised to u pa rin. And then, wag kalimutan yung plus c. And after that, pag na-integrate mo na siya, balik mo na yung x variable natin. So, yung u, papalitan mo lang ng x raised to 4 para sa problem na to. And makukuha na natin yung integral na, yung value ng integral na hinahanap natin. Like mo yung video kung ayos. Pag hindi, pag mo i-dislike, leave ka ng comment kung bakit, ha? Sige na, subscribe.